Camille Pizarro's Le Village à Travers les Arbres, The Village Seen Through the Trees, is a fascinating example, a monument to Pizarro's exploration of uh, the way that Impressionism was going to radically change the, the, the course of the history of art in the, the later 19th century. Camille Pizarro was born in the West Indies and began his training there, but it was really when he came to Paris that he started to experience the new and exciting influences that were prevalent in the city, training with Monet and Cezanne, both of whom were about 10 years younger. And so his very earliest pictures are right in the academic tradition of the 19th century. And it's only in the later 1860s that he starts to experiment and to find his, his voice. And so a picture like the village seen through the trees is, is where he's starting to see the revolutionary um, concept that he can bring to painting. The village seen through the trees has really exceptional provenance. It comes to Bonhams from the estate of only Olsen Dahini, and before her belonged to Lucy Batson Dahini, wife of Ned Dahini, the great storied Los Angeles family. Throughout her life, Mrs. Dahini devoted her time to her many passions, including her family, the art world, music church and numerous charities. She was particularly noted for her extensive and very generous philanthropic work throughout the Los Angeles community as a founding member of the colleagues raising funds for children's institutes and for other causes such as the uh, Dahini Eye Institute, the Los Angeles Orphanage Guild and as a life trustee of St. John's Hospital. She was a member of the Assistance League of Southern California, helping those less fortunate. Her philanthropic interests also extended to cultural activities including the Los Angeles County Museum of Art and the Los Angeles Philharmonic. It's very exciting for Bonhams to be um, offering this picture for sale. We've sold two beautiful Pizarro paintings in the last 12 months. The first from the Flanagan family in New York in November 2013, which was a little later on. And you can see the development from, from this picture to the Flanagan picture, how Pizarro is being so experimental. And then in December, of 2013 we sold from the collection of Dr. Gustave Rao a sketch done in Pontoise about five years after this. You can really see um, why Cezanne saw Pizarro as the great revolutionary painter. Um, this, this same motif of, of, of the screen of trees is something that, that Cezanne takes from Pizarro. And equally in these, these blocks of colour in the roofs, Again, you can see the, the, the beginnings of the fragmentation that Cezanne takes and develops. And so it's really in these loosely painted, beautifully painted uh, canvases by, by Pizarro that we can see the revolutionary mind that really gave birth to, to Impressionism. <laughs>